Hi there. So this will be a short review for the iRig mic, which I titled The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. Here's what you get in the box. Take a look. And let me start by mentioning some of the good things, some of the things that I liked about this microphone so far. And I'll begin with packaging. The microphone comes in a beautiful full color box, mostly red and white. And inside the box, you'll see some plastic wrapping that the microphone comes in. And this is really cool, especially if you buy this as a gift uh, for someone, because it'll make it look presentable. I also like the price on this. I think I spent $54 on it, which is pretty awesome for such a versatile microphone. I also like the sound on it. I'm using it right now, so as you can hear, the sound is pretty decent uh, without really doing any edits when I'm done recording. I also liked some of the features on the microphone itself. I'll show you in the picture here. The first feature I liked was that uh, the microphone has three settings. Let me show you also in a, in a real picture. And the three settings allow you to place the microphone at different distances from the sound source. And right now I'm using the first setting and I'm actually keeping the microphone about four feet away on my left. And that's the one I've been using. That's the setting I've been using for a while, both for speaking and also for playing on my nylon string guitar. I like the fact that this came with a clip, a microphone clip, which is pretty handy and pretty useful if you're going to use it on a stand. And I actually bought a tripod for it. Now this tripod does not come in the box, but I bought a tripod which was about $8 online, so I highly suggest you get one of these. It's going to be quite handy. Some of the other features that were good uh, are some of the apps that are suggested on the box here. And the one that jumped at me first was the one called Amplitube. And uh, when I was talking about my iRig 2, uh, I, I was talking about that app that goes with the iRig 2. And apparently, this goes with the, with the iRig mic as well. So I'm actually going to try and use both items with that app and see how they work. So that's pretty cool. I also like the options you get for connecting the microphone to different devices such as an iPhone, iPod, iPad because it has a three ring adapter. Take a look. There's also a headphone input which is pretty cool if you want to hear the live sound that you're recording. I haven't used that yet and I'm not planning to use it but it's there if you need it. Now some of the bad things that I didn't like uh, included the, the cable that the microphone comes with and take a look here. As you can see, the cable is pretty uh, thin and it's quite flimsy actually. So I'm assuming that this will not last a long time, especially if you use it often. Now, not only is the cable thin and flimsy, but it's also attached to the microphone. So that's really bad in my opinion, because that's gonna, that's gonna cause the cable to go bad much earlier than it should, because you can't really take it apart. Now what I really disliked was the fact that, see when I opened the box and I saw that there's a, there's a leather pouch, I really like that. It's really nice, it, it's, it's actually branded and it's zippered and uh, I really liked it when I saw it in the box. However, I really disliked the fact that you can't actually use it because, well, the microphone will fit in there, but because the cord is attached, you would actually have to bend the cord really hard in order for the whole thing to fit in there. Now if the cable, if the, if the cord came apart, if the cable came apart from the microphone, this would be perfect, but because that cable is attached, it's going to force you to bend that cord very badly and eventually break it. So this was, this was my least favorite uh, feature in the box. So I'm actually going to end up not using this pouch because it really makes no sense to me the way that they made it. So here's my short review of the iRig mic. I do plan to use it moving forward at least for a while and see how it works. Thank you for watching the video. See you in the next one. Have a nice day. Bye.